Welcome to the Lantern Post Game Show. I'm your host, Megan Hustline, alongside Nick Malika. Definitely a battle of the defenses between Penn State and Ohio State today. Just what were your initial thoughts on the game? Yeah, definitely defense controlled the game. But Ohio State's defense just looked better than Penn State's defense. They were really just giving it to Drew Aller. Yeah, neither of the offenses looked too great today. However, Ohio State's was slightly better. So just moving into our three takeaways of the game. First off, very slow start by Kyle McCord. He really struggled today. He only went 22 at 35. He had one touchdown, but overall he was just making passes that he usually, or he was missing passes, excuse me, that he usually makes. Just overthrows. Overall just didn't look comfortable out there. But second takeaway, Marvin Harrison Jr. He really saved him today. He had 164 receiving yards. He just played out of his mind. So definitely a great day from Marv. And obviously the biggest takeaway, the defense. They just played unbelievable. They limited Penn State to one of 16 on third down, third down conversions. And they had eight tackles for loss and four sacks. So just a super fun day from the defense, very high energy, and they performed so well today. Nick, what did you hear from Ryan Day at his press conference? Yeah, Ryan Day talked about, uh, talked about the defense a lot and how they, you know, they really control the game. But he also talked about the running back room as well. He felt that the running backs coach thought that my room and Chip were the guys to go to, mm -hmm. and that's why Dallin didn't get a lot of reps today or any reps, as a matter of fact. He also talked about Burke in there, too. He said Burke's close. You know, he's close to coming back mm -hmm. as well. And he talked about Mbuka as well. Coming back is close with them, too, and Henderson as well. Okay. So sounds like we are good on the injury front. It was surprising that, you know, Trey, Denzel, and Emeka were all out today. Ohio State still pulled out the win. And we got to give our player the game award. Obviously, Marvin Harrison Jr., like I said, those 164 receiving yards, that big touchdown that put the exclamation point on the game. So overall, great game from Marv. And another special shout out to the defense because they just played out of their minds. So overall, very interesting game from the Bucks. The defense has been leading them all year, and we saw that again today. So thank you for tuning in for the Lantern for coverage all day long.